I probably could have just warped straight over there, but I, I just felt like getting in the cannon. Oh, man. But yeah, it's been quite a day. Also, I, I did my second to last reading of Small Gods, which is now on YouTube. I didn't actually, whoops. I didn't know you could call her in the middle of the water. Let's hurry to the mirror chain. Yes, we will do that. Sorry, everybody. But yeah, if you're interested, check out my YouTube. I um, I had it just under like an audiobooks playlist, but I really should have every book under its own playlist. I wish you could have like a playlist of playlists. Maybe that's too many playlists. Um, but yeah, I've actually been getting a lot of positive feedback from random people on YouTube about uh, my readings, which is really great, actually. Like, I mean, I love hearing from the people that always like support me. But it's also kind of cool when just random people are like, hey, this is pretty cool. Keep it up. And you're just like, oh, thanks. Yeah. So, um, yeah, to the mirror chamber. Okay, I got to take off my shoes. Well, the funny thing is I just took off my shoes IRL as well. Oh, God, I went really far down really fast. We're okay, see, we're fine, we can breathe. But yeah, I also put up um, a straw pole. Uh, of course, I don't know the actual thing. Because um, I also made a tweet about it. Um, granted, if you've never read Terry Pratchett's works, you don't know what either of those books are about, but um, yeah, if, uh, if you want to vote on which book to, for me to read next, go ahead. Uh, both of them are very good. Um, one of them is my favorite, and the other one is also very good. Probably my second. I won't tell you which one, because then you'll probably just choose that one. Just choose whichever one looks more. Midna. Warp. Always carry a knife. Hello, RC. Just like you told me. Are you uh, are you all done collecting dues? Well, actually, you said that you were a while ago. In the mirror chamber. Oh, hey. Literally the mirror chamber. Don't worry, I ate a bit before starting, and I have two full bottles of water, so I should not run out of water. I'll probably have to pee before I need to get more. Well done, good. All right, are you guys ready? Make me not a wolf. Z. In time. Oh no, oh, why don't you tell them that you're all done for the day? I know it's already like 10 o'clock and you've been doing stuff. You did? Wait, did you cook yet? Oh. Oh. So you're talking about thawing stuff while you were cleaning. Some call our realm a world of shadows, but that makes it sound unpleasant. The twilight there holds a serene beauty. You have seen it yourself as the sun sets on this world. Bathed in that light, all people were pure and gentle. But things changed once that foul power pervaded the world. Talking about Ganondorf. With all our doing, we overestimated our ability as sages and attempted to put an end to Ganondorf's evil magic. I hope you can find it in yourself to forgive our carelessness. Oh, Twilight Princess. Link's just like, what? what are they, hey, what are they talking about? Call her that right now. What? Of course they knew. They're the sages. They know a lot of things. So you knew.
Da -da -da. They said the name of the game, guys. As a ruler who fled her people, I'm hardly qualified to forgive you. And she got turned into this. <laughs> they really did a lot of, like, exaggerated mouth stuff in this game. Gotta say. In our world, we've long believed that the hero would appear as a divine being. Well, I mean, wolves are pretty cool. That's why when I found you, I thought I could use you. Yeah, yeah here's that smile again. I only cared about returning our world. I didn't care what happened to the world of light, not at all. But after witnessing the selfless lengths that Princess Zelda and you have gone for sacrifices, now I now know in the bottom of my heart that must save this world too. There's no other way. We can just defeat Zant. The curse on me will dissolve, and we may be able to revive Zelda. Let's go, Chaos, for Zelda, for all this world. You're like, okay. Why not? Well. I forgot about a lot of things. Cooking Mama is scary. Enter. Whoop. of Twilight. Um, listen, Cass, can I ask you one last selfish favor? Regardless of what my reasons may have been, I once abandoned this world. I left behind the Twilight. Those who had followed me considered me their ruler. Even now, as they remain here suffering, they believe that hope will be. But if they were to see that the only help for them was a curious little imp. Do you think they'd feel let down? It's only for a little bit longer. Mind if I continue to hide as your shadow while you're in the form? Sorry. It's okay, but, uh... Hi. Wait, this guy isn't an enemy, Chaos. They might look different, but they're inhabitants of this world. People. Zen, how could he? Hey, he gave them all the plate faces. Sorry about your plate faces, guys. Okay, um. Hello, tall friend. Now we're in the, the Twilight Realm, which is different from the Twilight Zone. I kind of want to long. Uh, that reminds me, I think I'm missing like a couple of 
both skeletons. Oh yeah! <laughs> Gross sand head. Out of here. Treasure! I think it's a key. Yeah, also, I don't have any definitive, like, places. Um, oh god, I forgot. He's gonna tell me that. Yes, be careful. This black fog is made of shadow crystals created by Zant. They blot out light. He's responsible for stealing the light from the spirits and turning your world into twilight. But he's not all powerful. We're prepared, too. I can return you to your normal state whenever you need me, so don't worry, okay? But yeah, I think this Monday is when I'll definitely go around to the different, like, um, mobile home park, trailer park, whatever you want to call it. And I'm gonna, um, gonna see about what we've got there. Because if anything, I've already paid rent for the month, and like I said, um, if I leave early, my landlord would probably be okay with, like, paying the difference. Um, but if anything, what I could do is even if I move early, if it takes me a little bit to get all my stuff moved, I can just be like, just keep my stuff in my room until the end of the month and after that. So we'll see. I want to have a, a, a fairly decently set. Like, I could get a one-bedroom apartment again, but if I can get something bigger for about the same amount, I'll go for it. Plus, I, well, I, I would say I've been a little bit spoiled with this room because of the fact that it's made out of basically an entire garage, so it's a very large room. But I'm not taking the bed. It's a king-size bed, and I'm going to tell you right now, unless you have many, many rooms, or you have a room just devoted to literally just having the bed in it, the king-size bed kind of sucks. Because it's, it's just way too big. Especially for one person. I mean, I'll probably end up getting like a food. As long as I can sleep. Because, I mean, honestly, half of this king-size bed is taken up by plushes because I... I'm not... I only sleep on one side of it. I can find another place with it. Maybe a book. I think about shelter. Huh. We'll get it figured out. Okay, um... I don't think I can go through here. I think the whole point of this... Hey, or maybe I can. I guess I can walk through it. Fuck your birds! Never mind. It's a hole. Okay, that's not. It's not gonna work out. Then. Um. Okay. Well, go back in here. Maybe there's a way that I'm supposed to get up. No. Oh, see, there's a path behind the stuff. It's been a little while. I think I can, oh wait, you know, I think I can totally grab on. I think I, I think I can grab on. I can, okay. There we go. I got the key, so. Oh, it's all coming back. I think I can knock that back at him with the shield, maybe? Yeah. I don't know how much damage he does. Or it just stuns him. I got turned into a wolf. Get out of here. That's another key. 
remember this place being kind of weird. Oh, and then another chest. Lots of chests. Thanks. Thank you. I don't know what the other one is. Maybe bombs? I don't know if I need bombs. Usually they'll give you something. Over here. Shit. Man. Thank you. Here, a map, maybe? Well, no, I think we have the map of the place. It's the compass! Okay, I guess, because this is still technically dungeon-y. Okay, we're just gonna... We're gonna have to hoof it. Just turn me into a wolf now. that from there? Can I reach it from here? I suppose a pair of lyrium breasts tattooed onto my chest would make things better. Hi, Beth! How are you doing? Hopefully it's not... Is it... Is it... Really cold there right now? I don't know if you... If you guys just kind of go through, like, cold snaps or if it stays consistently cold for the winter. Like, right now, we're in kind of a cold snap or it's finally hitting, like wintry time here uh, because it's actually been below freezing fairly consistently in the past uh, week and a bit. Which, funnily enough, um, during Christmas and New Year's, it was like sweaty. It, it was sweaty weather. And I was like, man, we're just not going to have winter. And then I get home. Actually, the day I drove home, January 2nd, um, it was, it got down to like negative eight, which is, you know, for us, it's pretty damn cold. I was like, dang. Winter got hands all of a sudden. No warmth here, unless you go to fireplace. Oh. Have you been okay with getting, like, um, gas and stuff for your, your boiler? Using a bunch of old costume things to make a cat witch hatch? Oh, that's amazing! I don't want to see, definitely want to see that when it's done. Or the, the process. Or both. Well, I guess. Yeah. I've been going through kind of stuck in because I'm like I need to, I need to drop some stuff. I'm actually, I'm the, I'm actually getting rid of my GameCube, which a lot of people would be like, but chaos, you play a lot of old games and stuff. Um, I the only thing I really need to use my GameCube for at this point is if I wanted to play like. Game Boy games on my PC without emulating, but apparently Dixie's is sending me a thing that can play cartridges. So at this point, I have a Wii. I have a Wii U. I'm like, I don't really need the GameCube anymore, and it's just more wires. So I'm I'm getting rid of that, and and like I think some of my like older games, like my Nintendo, Super Nintendo games, and all that, like it's cool having them, but it is expensive as fuck being a collector, and I'm definitely not what you would call a collector, so I'm like, I don't know, I just might need to make some things. And, uh, work on that. Like, it has a little bit of sentimental value, but it's also just like, I gotta think of what's best for, like, moving around. And that. Yeah, so far is okay, but thanks for the reminder you should call. Okay, yeah! I I'm just making sure, because I know that's a big thing for you. And I, I don't want you to be caught, like, without a means of, of eating and stuff. I know, I, I have a couple of friends that apparently have been out of like electricity and stuff for a few days in the middle of snow and I'm like, man, that is literally the worst. Get a tiny space heater for it. Okay. Um... Oh, 
Oh, well, that was gross. Stop! Stop! <laughs> eh, okay, wait, I think I just have to keep killing everything. Hopefully to a loving home. I hope so too, like, and I'm not, I just have it like an, an auction type thing on eBay, because I'm not trying to like rob people, but I'm kind of like, I am moving. So I wouldn't mind if I made a little money off. But yeah, it, and it's been like, it still works fine. It, I, 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 that was one of the things is like tested. This thing is like, God, I don't know. I've probably had it for like 15 or so years. So it's just like, man, it's weird to think about that too. Hey, Anna, welcome. How are you doing today? Well, I mean, I know we talked earlier, but I hope, I hope you've been. Please. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yep. Okay, so we wait until he makes a big ball and then we stab him in and run. Got it. I'm still doing fairly well. I was in a, I was in a video call with uh, Kat earlier because, um, a gift that I sent her had shown up. Finally, I I technically ordered the thing like on the 10th of December and then Amazon was like, it'll get there between the 18th and the 22nd. And then it never, it never updated. <laughs> so she was like, I got a package. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure it's the one I sent, but who knows for certain. Thankfully, mo most of the people that I, I, I sent stuff to, it showed up relatively. Awesome. That shining sphere illuminates this world. It's called a soul. It's like the sun of your world, Kratos. The power of the soul is the source of life in this world. It is your power. Ah, as long as you have this, would you take this soul to the twilight at the entrance of this world? Please, Kratos. Because I bought Christmas gifts for, for most everybody. Because, you know what, I am i wasn't really able to do it at all last year. So it was kind of nice this year being able to do so and, and not being like, oh man, I just can't afford this. Oh yeah, I have to hit it. I was like... But yeah, I remember now the hand is bad and it's like, I want the light. But it's mine. I can't remember dropping this. Did I do anything? Oh yeah, how's that? Oh yeah, and then I remember I have to. My ball. Oh, I'm glad you're doing. shoot it with arrows to make it stop. Oh god. There's. Yeah, get out of here with that. Oh, okay, you had to hit it like three times. I don't know why, but I thought there was a chest up there. Um. Crap, how am I supposed to get it? Uh. Oh, wait. I think I was. Whoops. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was supposed to grab it while I was up there. Sorry, everybody. I don't know how to... I don't know how to properly care for my balls. Actually, that's not... Don't worry about it. Um... Uh... Oh, got it. Okay, there we go. Much better. Hit. 
Eh, I'll take that. Fuck you! Eh! <laughs> Here! Yeah, I know, I know. Spooky hand man. One more for another uh, heart container. Hi, bye. Yep. Hey, come out. Get away. Got it. I don't think it follows. Well, it might follow me out. But I can't remember. Actually. Safe. Yeah, that's what they look like. They're pretty normal. Hi. Bathe in the light of the sun. Glad that they're not all super gone. All right. Pew. Yes, there should be one more soul. If we can find that. It should lead us to Zen. Got it. cook so much stuff guys like when I move out I am I'm seriously in my new place I'm going to run that kitchen into the ground in a good way you know I get, put it through its paces might sound better running things into the ground is bad anyway there's gonna be a lot of cooking that's that's what I was trying to say um oh great there's cats Oh. Okay, so I got it. Aim better. What the? I, I don't like these skinny bats. <laughs> okay, good. Even with Z targeting, I feel less bad at shooting. Because they're just. Oh. Just wanted to be dead. Got it. All right, let's go. Oh, wait, I probably should have. Whoops. What am I gonna cook first? I'm honestly, first try, thanks. Look, my hair, I don't have hair to flip. Um, You know, to be perfectly honest, Beth, I'm not entirely sure, but I do wanna dig in. I have a bunch of cookbooks that I have yet to dig into, but uh, my friend Kat got me this, which is like, a 700 page cookbook of classic Italian cooking. Um, so I'll, I'll probably pick something out of here. I think I, I think I might start with a bread because I really like bread and I really want to get in, more into uh, bread making, you know? Um, and I, I think one of the rules I'm going to give myself when I move out is that I'm not allowed to buy like pre-made confections basically like no no like no like cookies or cakes or other things that I could make myself so that way I just make it myself you know I haven't really been able to cook as much here because there's always dirty dishes in the sink and other things and uh it's a small kitchen like well 
that's not even an excuse there because you can cook stuff in a small kitchen. It's just dealing with all the, the bullshit of roommates and other stuff and the possibility of your stuff that, like, there were plenty of times where I left out butter to, um, to soften and that's not what I wanted to say. And they would put it back in the fridge and I'm like, don't, I, it's, I, it's, this isn't just suddenly gonna go bad. Like, don't, I need this to be soft. If your butter isn't soft, it messes up the consistency of your cookies and things. But they also don't really understand anything about cooking. I don't know. It's like pissing in the wind. So I am pretty ready to just have my own place to be able to do whatever. But, but yeah. Most likely going to be some kind of bread and, and, and possibly a pasta dish. Because I do love pasta. So, I just need to... You just need to cook stuff with more like fresh ingredients. Like that. That's that's. The thing. Oh, that probably has the key in it. But I do also have a bread book. I have a lot of cookbooks that I really haven't used recipes from. So I feel like, and then there's gonna be more cooking streams. And I think I'll just have more cooking videos in general as I go through the books and like share recipes, and stuff like that. See how things turn out. Just to have more fun with it. Thankfully, I still do have friends in the area, so I mean, if I make too much, I can just be like, do you guys like want bread? Because <laughs> thankfully, when it comes to bread and stuff, um, you know, it's really cheap ingredients. Like, you can make a ton of bread, for not a lot of money. Oh, hello. Okay. Uh, God, it's dark. Okay. So... Oh, okay, they're dead. Um, but yeah, it's it's definitely, like I've wanted to do more cooking and all that, especially more cooking. Um, so it's good to have that freedom. Cause that's the thing that sucks. Even as an adult, if you have roommates, depending on your roommates, there's, there's a good chance that you won't really have as much freedom as you think. Partially because sometimes they just kind of get in the way. Or they just don't understand the things you do. I, I don't know. At least with streaming, it's it's easy enough because I just go in my room and I close the doors and we're good. You know? They don't they don't get in the way with that. Kind of stuff, but yeah, roommates are a gamble. And I mean, I know these people, which made like being roommates with them like not as bad at first. But the fact that one of them has just become more and more passive aggressive and now has a child and you know, there's just a lot of factors and I'm like man I'm ready to not be but yeah I need to make more bread and stuff you know one of the things I need to get as well is it's on my my Amazon wish list but I need to get one of those cast iron um tortilla presses because I I'm going to try to be kind of like self-sufficient with everything that I possibly can, you know, within reason. But like, like snacks, like cakes and cookies and stuff, like those are so easy to make. So it's like, there's no reason why I should have to keep relying on, on store-bought stuff. And honestly, like stuff you make yourself is just very satisfying. Like, we'll, we'll try to make that a thing. I is there a, there's yes here and I very much enjoy cooking just I'm not exactly in an environment that makes it great for me to do so or attempt to. another stamp it's Zant man I don't want Zant Zant sucks Oh, there's a lot of, a lot of chests. Ooh. It'll be nice, because I can probably, if anything, um, if I have a kitchen kind of like the one here, where it's just like 
kind of a long, skinnier kitchen, I could get a bookshelf for the end of it where I can keep all of my cookbooks at. Instead of them just kind of like randomly being in drawers and stuff, because not a lot of places to put them in the kitchen here. I'll definitely there's gonna be a, a lot of decorations and stuff like that that I'll, I'll probably work on we shall see yeah no matter where I end up I will I will make the the best use of the space that I can and that's a, another thing I should I should try to do is just make more traditional dishes of a lot of it because like I know I've been interested in a lot of different foods from a lot of different places, but I just never really had the inclination to make it. Or I guess I just never, I, I didn't have the drive because like I said, like with where I'm at, I'm just kind of like, eh. I go to the kitchen to make food and then I go immediately back to the kitchen. So the kitchen experience is like more of like a chore than me being like, aha, yes, creative, expressive freedom and such. Make big poop cookies? I will. You should really, like, God. You know, my roommate has a 3D printer. I should learn how to use that and then make, like, a big poop cookie. But yeah, like, I, there's a lot of different dishes I want to make. I should make, like, finish this well. But actually make them the correct way. Don't be, like, like the lady who's like, a real Mexican nachos, and then she pours like a gallon of fucking nacho cheese on the counter and like puts her hands in it. It makes me mad when people don't know how to like what they're doing. Speaking of which, oh Beth, um a funny thing. I watched um uh, I don't know if you watched it or if you really cared about it at all. Um but I watched uh, Encanto the other day with uh, some friends the movie night and I know it's supposed to be like a, a Colombian thing um, but well I think the first mistake I made is that we watched it in English and I was like it probably would be better if I watched it <laughs> not in English I don't know more impactful maybe um, but one of the things is apparently the the food that the mom makes to like heal everybody like Disney had a tweet about it where they're like oh make this like with your family but the, what they neglected to mention is apparently if you prepare that wrong it it can literally explode in your face so some people like were like Disney what are you doing you can't just make this sound like it's something that kids can just make that anybody can make. Get out of here. You like that movie? I, 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 I liked it quite a bit too. Uh, the only thing, I only caught arepas, which are not something you know how to make. South American cuisine. Oh yeah. I, I figured since it is kind of on the other side of the world, but, but yeah, apparently uh, some natives were like, you you have to actually prepare for these. Like you can't just make them and be like, ah oh, yes, this this is a dish for everybody to make. But, but yeah, I, I think my biggest gripe with the movie, and this it's not really gonna spoil much of anything, um, because I, I'm not gonna divulge like what exactly happened. But the problem is that, I, and I was talking with uh, a couple of friends about it, is that um, the abuela kind of. She's kind of to like really toxic, honestly. But, uh, you know, that's kind of a common theme with some cultures or just like the ridiculous expectations that nobody can meet. Um, but at the end of the movie, it's just kind of like, oh no, everything's forgiven and everything's fine because uh, we all work together. And I'm just like, 
I don't know, she still was really kind of shitty to you guys for many years, but I mean, I guess you can't just be like, okay, Abuela, time to go to Abuela Jail. <laughs> I don't know if Abuela Jail is a thing. Hey. Excuse me. Uh, oh, I have to, oh gosh, I forgot. This part is, I don't like it. Hello, hearts please. I think I have to grab a doodad. No, how do I get up there? Uh, okay. Maybe I have to. Go away, hand. To, that is good intentions, not the, yeah, no, exactly. It's just, it, it, it's another one of those things where they, they're like, it's the Disney magic of everything's forgiven after the fact. It, well, and Disney has a track record of either killing off the people who did bad things or just forgiving them of everything because of the fact that they're family. Even if what they did was, like, terrible. There we go. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, Jiggly, welcome! Punish, I mean, it's true. I mean, maybe. I, actually, I don't know. Abuela punishment problem. That sounds like not something that would be a Disney movie. But we can talk about that later. I don't want to be a wolf right now. But how are you doing, Jiggly? How was your, how was your stream? How have you been? Uh, God, please give me that. <laughs> Yeah, welcome on in, Raiders. I hope you're all doing well today. I'm working on the last bits of Twilight Princess. Eh, stay in there. For the raid. It is good to see you. And it's been good seeing... Uh, like I said, I always I always see, like, your... Your updates and everything on, on Instagram and all that. It's been cool seeing the things that you've done. I... How do I get that here? This seems awfully far. Oh, wait. It's not. I got it. Don't listen to me. I don't know. Rage-inducing, to say the least. Actually, what were you? Oh, you were... Oh, okay. I could see why that would be rage-inducing. Because Pokemon Unite is... Is basically League of Legends, but with Pokemon. I've seen people play it, and I'm like, oh, I... Seems pretty cool. And uh, I mean, at least there's a lot less Pokemon to deal with. So maybe it's easier to figure out like the uh, the strengths and weaknesses and all that. Oh, hello. Oh, I forgot. I'm, oh geez. Wait, oh, no, oh, wait, oh, we made it. Okay, wait, I'm pro. Well, I hope that overall you had more fun than rage mode. <sighs> Got stuck with bad teammates who don't know the meaning. Oh no, oh uh, yeah. That's what was happening with my friend when I was watching her play. She's like, they're not, like, assisting in any way or not going to the correct areas. And I'm like, oh. I mean, to be fair, I don't know much about MOBAs, but I can tell when people are good at them because they don't die as much. But also because they seem to, like, know exactly where to go. You still have fun, though, because Pokemon? Of course. Well, I'm glad that you had fun. But yeah, going back to the thing, obviously... Yeah, he has to go to Abuela Jail for, I don't know. I mean, I get it. I, I guess the other thing is she had like a really rough life. So she was just kind of like, this can't happen again, no matter the cost. Even if the cost is like the sanity of your grandchildren. But yeah, I mean, I guess at the end it was kind of like, oh, I get it. What I did was bad and I promise not to do bad Abuela things anymore or make people think like if they don't meet my expectations, they might as well 
be gone. Light filled the Master Sword. Its blade glows with a golden light in the Twilight Realm. With it, you can cut through dark fog. Yay! You got to ultra level at one point because you got a good teammate. But you went back to lower rank and now it's... No! Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I don't know how bad it is with Pokemon Unite, but I know I have a friend that plays League a lot, and apparently it's really easy to lose ranks because you lose, like, a lot of points if you if if you lose a lot. I mean, she also plays Wild Rift, which is, like, actually has different places, and the amount of points you lose compared to the amount of points you gain when you win is kind of... But yeah, not a one-way street. I mean... Yeah, howdy. Glad to hear you do it. I mean, true, true. There was some other bullshit going on as well. I mean, I guess it's just one of those things where I'm kind of like, eh, well, I feel like they could have resolved it differently. But at the same time, I mean, Disney movies tend to do the same thing where the resolution is just like, here you go, we did it, it's the end, haha, -ha, everybody's happy now. And you're like, okay. I mean, unless they made another movie that was like, Abuela's uh, redemption. I don't know. I don't think. I mean, I guess she kind of redeemed herself just by being like, oh, I should probably not do that. <laughs> Amazing. The power of the souls has been transferred into your sword. Sorry I stole your large energy, of course. Guardian deities of my world are on our side, too. You really are the chosen one, Chaos, a true hero. As long as you have that sword, you should be able to repel the shadows that spread. I kind of, you know, it's one of those movies where I'm like, eh, I liked it, but I don't really need to watch it again. But at the same time, now I kind of feel like watching it again, just not in English. Because I, I feel like, like I heard a couple of the songs uh, and I was like, man, these definitely sound like way better, not in English. <laughs> I don't know. There's just something about it. They, they just hit different. Can you? The weather? How are, oh, wait, really? How bad is it? I'm doing all right. It's it's chilly here, but not as bad as it could be. Anyway, I mean, I, I, I'm not saying don't watch Encounter, because I, I think it was a, a fairly good movie. I think the other thing is, is just uh, my friend was kind of like, and, and I understand this too. One of the annoying things that Disney likes to do, um, like when they, they did stuff with Poco, uh, is they make a movie and they're kind of like, hey, look, haha, we're bringing, uh, we're bringing like stuff like this more to light, like other cultures and stuff like that. But they also Disney-fy it, you know, so. Sometimes it just seems like it's a lot more about Disney than it actually is about the culture. I guess there's only so much you can do. It's kind of like when Hollywood gets a hold of literally anything and turns it into dog shit. They're like, well, guess that's just Hollywood. That could be good. Oh, really? I don't know. I probably should watch more stuff in Spanish anyway, as we discussed. Just because, you know, if you're learning a language, it's good to ingest media in that language to kind of broaden your horizons. I gotta get the ball directly. Yep. What? Uh, hello? Hello? Did not ask for this. Spin! Like, okay. Don't judge me, but I watched Twilight Breaking Dawn Part 2 last night. I haven't seen, I've literally seen no parts of Twilight before. Um, the only experience I had with Twilight series was knowing that it was not good and also uh, watching cinema therapy on YouTube like tear into them and be like That's not a good relationship um, But we were watching it mostly so I could yell about it and I I did yell about it an awful lot Okay, there we go. Fill it with power of light. But yeah, it's just not good. <laughs> it's just not good. Like every time the vampires ran, because if you don't know this, apparently all of the vampires run very quickly. And I'm just like, this is 
some of the stupidest stuff I have seen in my life. Like, holy shit. I don't know how many of you have watched Buffy the Vampire Slayer, but Buffy the Vampire Slayer came out a very long time ago. And I was like, man, you know what? Seeing vampires do vampire stuff in that show was like better than watching anything that happened in Twilight. I was just like, damn guys, like, We've advanced so much with CGI, and the only thing you managed to do with it was make a terrifying baby. They should have used a real baby. That thing was awful. Who the fuck decided we needed a CGI baby? Fire them. Anyway. They want- Oh, uh, animatro- Oh, no, yeah, it was so- Uh, you like the vamps? in the series of the originals. I don't think I've seen that. I've seen a little bit of True Blood. The only thing I really know about True Blood though is that there is an awful lot of sex in it. Which I feel like was the draw, but I remember like I, I was at home once because I think it was on HBO Max or Showtime. I don't even know if HBO Max was a brand at the time. But our roommates were watching it and I just walk in and I'm like, what the fuck is this? And they're like, it's true blood. And I'm like, ah, oh, okay. And then I left the room. It was, it was, it was basically just porn. The scars guard and wolf machina. Yeah. I mean, they, they, they seemed like they, like when it came to the story bits, it seemed like they, they had it pretty together, but it feels like every time I walked into the room while they were watching it, somebody was having sex with someone. I'm like, dang, this is a, there's a lot of this going on in this show. Damn. Yeah, no, animatronic baby. Like, like I don't, like, I don't know how hard it, it sounds weird. How hard is it to find a baby? I, well, I guess, I guess it's hard to keep, like, I don't know how long it took them to film the movie, but I guess finding a baby and then getting all of the different shots done in a timely manner before the baby was, not a different looking baby. Yeah, and they're not just sparkly. That always got me too. I was just like, mm, I don't know about this, guys. Um, is this gonna uh, is that gonna is this gonna last the whole time? I hope so. Hey, Jay, I'm falling. Get away. Okay, please go that way. Thank you. Okay. A lot happening right now. Like, I don't know. I feel like almost literally every vampire something got vampires pretty good other than other than Twilight. Here. Oh, are you? And the the whole hat? Here. Oh, I gotta go. I killed that guy. Maybe there's another guy. Wait, I want to see how much, cause oh my God, I've hand sewn before and hand sewing is cool, but also holy shit. It, yeah, it's, that's a lot for a hand. You're giving it like the belt. Oh, and then is the, oh God. Is the belt thing you're putting on it? Is it, is it just fabric or is it like leather? God damn, sewing leather hurts. Even if it's like a thinner leather. Morgan is, <laughs> I mean, this is true. I mean, vampires in games are, are pretty good usually. Baby was supposed to be really weird, like adult baby, but eerily cute. I was wondering, because I don't know if I'd call that baby cute. It was just terrifying. Cause I was like, there's, it's just, it was very unsettling. Maybe, like, I don't know if they were supposed, if that was what they were going for, but it definitely, yeah, cause I know she aged, yeah. Okay, I gotta say, even the kid they used when she was slightly older, I was like, man, this feels like a kid they'd use in like a horror movie. <laughs> Sorry, child. Uh... I think the other thing that got me Honestly, was the fact that like the the whole like the the 
the whole fucking thing where there's like 20 minutes of fighting and bullshit and all that. And then they're like, oh, actually, uh, it didn't actually happen. That was just a vision. And I was like, wow. Like, I don't know how many tropes you can put in this movie, but I, I was just like, man, that's the one. That's, ah, uh, man. Yeah, just, yeah, just the baby. But like, I don't know. She, she just, that kid looked like she could have been perfect as like a kid in a horror movie. No offense, child. God, I forgot I got it. Try that, cause that, oh, it wasn't in the, oh. Oh, really? So they just fucking, okay. So they caused a whole lot of weird shit for no re, oh. Man, Hollywood really does, like, I mean, I guess I can't say it much about the books because I never read them, but I just always assumed that they weren't really, like, exceptional in any way. They just, I mean, it's kind of like Fifty Shades of Grey, which apparently is just trash, but people ate it up because they don't know what, I don't know, they don't know what a relationship is. The bad guys can't do shit. Okay. Well, cause I know, yeah, in the movie she was doing the shieldy thing and I was like, ah. Oh. They had a surprise. I feel like, I don't know if that would be a good surprise. Not that it was any better. <laughs> oh man. Oof. No, I don't want to go down. Well guys, we went down. Down is not up. No, please. Okay. Go away. Let's go. Mary, Mary Sue protagonist can do all the, yeah, true. I gotta say though, th like in the first fucking shit ass titties, sorry. I'm bad at puzzles apparently when it's not Monday. Um, The thing that got me was, you're sorry about the vampires that came to fight. Yeah, and they didn't do shit. All they did was like rip each other's heads off. Okay, okay, I got it. Got a vision, nothing, yeah. Like, you know those two hot, like, chicks? Like, the, the one who could, like, change the way that people saw things or put images in their mind? And I was like, holy shit. And that, but I was like, you know what? She's really cool and all, but I don't think we're gonna get anything past, like, she's not gonna do anything. Yeah, that's not how you do that. Like, then all the other characters literally got pushed aside and Bella was just like, hey, look, it's me, I'm Bella. I'm badass now, I guess. And everybody else is like, oh, okay, well, I'm also here. I mean, I also hadn't like read any of the other stuff. So I had no emotional connection with any of the people who were dying. I was just like, oh, well, there's another dead guy, I guess. Cool. Aha! Swunk. But yeah, it was just like, man, this, it was just really bad. The pacing was terrible. Um, also, the fact that Jacob was imprinted on an infant was really fucking creepy. And, but they still let him stay in the house, I guess? I fucking, I hate this. Yeah, it was a fan fiction, but it was just, well, uh, it was so bad. It was so bad, though. <laughs> it was so bad. Oh God, I was just like, they really, this. I'm gonna do my best not to do the next time. I got hit by the jerk. He was in love with the egg that, yeah. And I was just like, and he kept calling her. He's like, yeah, Nessie. I'm like, oh, please. God, just everything about that movie. I was like, mm, yeah, but no, seriously, Beth. I think you would have got, I wish I had recorded myself because when I saw them start running through the forest, I fucking lost it. I lost my mind. Cause I was like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> You're gonna, yeah, exactly. The week before, yeah, wow, yeah. Really, yeah. It was just the whole thing was, it put a very bad taste in my mouth. I was like, man. Do not appreciate this plot line at all. Stop hitting me! Please.
please tell me that that's all the things I have to kill. Oh, I did it. Was the sat? Yeah. You know what? That's the funny thing is that my friend was like, but they have really good music, and I'm like, look. It like choosing good music for a movie is cool, but I'm still like, man, as a whole, good music will not change what they did. Oh, the door. Yeah. The door. And Fifty Shades of Grey. Well, yeah. And honestly, Anna, I wouldn't subject you to that anyway because it's a very bad um, take on BDSM. Which is to say, it's not. It's really, it's just not that. But people are like, they will swear up and down. They're like, yeah, it's like, it's like, no. This is not how that works at all. That's, that's not that, that was just exploitation and shit and just not good. Bad. Oh wait, I'm missing, where's the big key? Where's the big key? What happens if you don't swing the sword? Oh, then. Then this this stuff gets me. Right. I'm not sure. Where the hell? I can't remember where the big key is. Um. Oh, don't tell me it was on the third floor. Oh, wait, was it back there? need the big they tried to romanticize the big yeah but they also they were off the mark with how it even works so they fucked it up Is this, well <laughs> i mean kind of when you say it that way anna it's it, it's it probably sounds very bad but no it, i mean i've told you about i mean you did that little test and stuff um but yeah yeah they tried to romanticize the that's what it really was. Like, that was not a true, like, dom-sub relationship. That, that was just an abusive relationship with a dom-sub, like, mask on. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Where the f Where is that chest? Oh, it's in the other room. Okay, I think this is going to take me all the way down. I think I can get back up here now from there. That's how none of it worked. Yeah, no. No, 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 no. You're fine, Anna. But yeah, it's just... Basically, if you ever do watch Fifty Shades of Grey just to see what all it's about, just know that it's just... It's not... It, it misses the mark of every point it tries to make, basically. But a lot of women still love it for whatever reason, or they're, they just romanticize. The, the thing is they're just romanticizing like a hot rich guy, you know? Uh, but the thing is there's a difference between like hot rich guy and hot rich guy who totally leverages his position to abuse the fuck out of you, <laughs> which is bad. Doesn't interest you? Yeah, exactly. Like, you, you have no reason to watch it. There should be... All these birds? Is that big? Hello, birds. Yeah, well, and that's the problem, too. Is, I mean, people will find the actors and stuff attractive, and then they'll be like, oh, yeah, everything's all good, haha. -ha. And it's like, no, no. I mean, as long as you understand that the content of the movie is just ass. I mean, it, it's kind of like with Twilight, the actors actually kind of hated everything about what they were doing, but, you know, money. 
seeing on meter and published him. Yeah. Well, and I feel like that was the start of just a lot of kind of like bad book to movie uh, transitions because Hollywood realized they could just make bank if they just turned whatever into a movie if the fan base was big enough. Even if the movie was not good. There's initially an indie film. Okay, well... We really need to dig... If there's something. Because there's a, a... Apparently a chest. Behind the waterfall. Well, not really a waterfall. Yeah, I don't get it either. And you know what? Everybody that I know that loved Twilight was like, all oh, the fucking teenage people. Like, everybody. And now they watch it now and they're like, well, most of them, I guess, are like, oh, wow, this is actually awful and I don't know why I like it. I really get it. Either. But yeah, I don't know. That's the thing I hate is that, like, they will literally publish, like, anything for money and I'm like, some things just don't need to be published, guys. Just, just, what the f hey, there's gotta be a am missing. Oh, there totally is. Wow, I'm sorry, everybody. With Hyperland, this is also The Millennials are team, yeah. They say as one. Um, aha! I really hope that's the yes. Okay, we found the key. I just oh, that chest looks kind of gross, actually. We just hit when they come here. Also, everyone, is, yeah. <laughs> I bad bite. T pose. Okay. Well, I think that's the door I want to be outside of anyway. No, it's fine. That's actually that's exactly what I wanted to do. Probably. About well, Uber Eats. Thanks for telling me that you had a 35 places that I don't need. Okay. Time to go back up. They need a marketing fandom. Did yeah. This is true, and that's one of the things that gets me is when something really doesn't deserve the praise or the the attention it's getting, but the fandom just, like, keeps pushing. And the other thing is, like, bad, um, uh, like, bad, uh, bad publicity is still publicity, so even if people were shitting on it, it was still getting it into the public eye, and it was just never going away. Kind of like Mariah Carey during Christmas. Don't get me wrong, I'm okay with Christmas music now. I used to kind of hate it, because I worked in retail. Um, but, we'll tell you what, it, it, I'm, that is not something I will ever play at people. Because, I want my friend. Hello? Oh, hello. Plus, Christmas jazz is way better. Team Edward Fire refused to go back to cinema after the first thing, yeah. I, okay, but I, I'm, I'm sure that obviously at this point you can agree now that he was just fucking terrible and gaslit the hell out of her all the time, but she was just kind of like, he's probably right, and you're just like, oh, no. baby, no, please. What? What do you mean? I respond. Wait, did you send me another one? Oh, shit. Well, because you responded, like, immediately after, so I probably didn't see it. Oh, huh. So, okay, so that's one of the Steam cards. I was 15, you read that, you didn't... Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. I mean, I'm not... Like, when we were younger, we thought a lot of things... And granted, like... I'm 33 years old, so a lot of stuff that people are see and they're like, Oh, man, this is so great, I'm like... 
Oh, oh boy, let me tell you how not great that is. But yeah. So cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, understand. But the movie's definitely cemented it. Like, still, I keep on saying this to my friend who watched, because I think it's the first movie when he fucking, like, climbs the tree with Bella on his back, and he's like, hang on tight, spider monkey, and it gets me every fucking time. Like, I'm just like, what the fuck is this? Oh, uh, <laughs> God. Woo, boy. I was just like, oh, because I remember when I saw that scene, that's when I was like, I'm never going to watch these movies. <laughs> oh, God. Zant. And now it's time. Zant is gross face. Isn't it this ironic? Here we are, all thanks to the dark magic curse you placed on Chaos. You speak. Magic, still your tongue for a moment, whelp, and I will tell you of both magic and the oppression of it. The people of our tribe, a tribe that mastered the arts of magic, were locked away in this world like insects in a cage. Yeah, also sparkly vampires, yeah. In the shadows, we regressed so much that we soon knew neither anger nor hatred. Or even the faintest bloom, desire. And it was all the fault of a useless, do nothing royal family that had re resigned itself to this miserable half existence. He's very flexible and angry. I had served and endured in that depraved household for far too long, my impudent princess. And why, you ask? Because I believed that I would be the next to rule our people. That is why. <clears throat> but why would they acknowledge me as their king? No! And as such, I was denied the magic powers befitting our ruler. It was then in the thrall of hatred and despair that I turned my eyes to the heavens and found a god. But are you know, Yeah, no. Go take care of your plants. Oh, maybe if you weren't such a jerk, they'd consider it, bro. Don't it? I, well, I can't. I can't stop the <laughs> scene. Oh, yeah, I forgot he's got a tattoo on his forehead. It's our boy! I shall house my power in you. <clears throat> if there is anything you desire, then I shall desire it too. I'm gonna have to iron this hat and don't have an iron. Oh no! His face, iron my hat, please. Well, he is giving him the power for anything he desires. So if he desires to iron your hat, by God, he's gonna iron that hat. I don't know, Zant seems more into just being incredibly flexible and annoying. Fucking around, please. Nope. Oh. Just whatever you say. Usurper King Zant! That's that guy. Okay, I believe in you, Beth. I know it's a pain in the butt or the hand. Oh god. I um Yes.
Okay, you're still here? Okay. Ow, 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 ow. Oops, wrong. Cool. As you use the different tools that you got to fight him, because you keep moving between areas. I'm gonna need my... Now? Oh, where's the iron boots at again? Okay, so he gets tuckered at after shooting. Now I'm underwater. I need to put on. Uh, but, but. I need to be able to breathe. Into your dumb face. Oh, wait, I think I have to. Yeah, get over here. Watch me kick Zant's ass. It's Yeah, anyway, so, Twilight, bad. Uh, fucking... Fifty Shades of Grey, even worse for different reasons. Probably, if you watch the movies, watch them for entertain... Well, I don't even if you know if, if there's really much entertainment value in Fifty Shades of Grey. Um, but... More like, watch them as a lesson of what to not do. Like anything that they do in those movies. Get out of here. Off of there! that I haven't used in a while. Ow! Ow. Zant, you're such a jerk! What's my favorite movie? Oh, God, that's hard. Now he's back. Oh god, I should probably not be wearing... Star Wars 9? What is... What, I don't even know. That's too many numbers. I don't know what 9 would be. Isn't that the one everybody hated? <laughs> well, I feel like they didn't like, like, Last Hope and... Or Jedi. I don't fucking know what the names are. Too many. Oh, you're gonna be... God, I, you know, it's hard. I, there's a lot of things. Okay, Super Mario Bros. live action movie is pretty good because of how bad it is and how much of not a Mario movie it is. Um, 
You know, I think the movies that I've watched the most would pro it would probably be a contest between either Hook with Robin Williams, you know, the one about Peter Pan, or The Fugitive with Harrison Ford, which is a very good movie. Now you have swords. You don't know how to use. I mean, I have been watching a lot of, like, the Marvel movies lately, and, um, I've quite enjoyed those, but I wouldn't say any are, like, my favorite. Okay, dude, how many, how much can you spend? Those are good. Yeah. Like, I remember when I, 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 I the first time I watched The Fugitive, I was like, holy shit, this, this is very good. Um, I don't know if you're missing much. Most of the people that I know who have watched the Eternals just did not like it. Like, my friends were like, you're not losing anything by not watching this movie. They like class Yeah. I really need to watch more. Like, I, I, I like classic movies, and I also like, um, okay, it, 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 if it comes down to it, I know it's a silly movie. Um, but when it comes to like martial arts films, I think my favorite one is still Kung Fu Hustle, even though it's it's pretty dumb, but it's very good. Although the Ip Man movies are fairly good. They're also actually serious martial arts. Devil's Advocate? I don't know if I've watched that. The Kung Fu Hustle. Ah, oh, it's so good. Just. Uh, it's just very campy, and I don't know, there's, there's a lot of good. silly. <sighs> you traitors! <laughs> traitors, huh? You want to know why none would call you king? It was your eyes, Zant. All saw it, a lust for power burning in your pupils. Did you think we'd forget get our ancestors lost their king to such greed? Is it with Al Pacino? Can oh, I will have to check that out then. Sorry, you know what? I don't know why, but when I thought of the Devil's Advocate, the very first thing that popped into my head was the Devil Wears Prada because that's the movie with Devil also in the name. But those are two completely different films. Um, yeah, the Lord of the Ring movies are. In a delicious twilight princess, the curse on you cannot be broken. It was placed on you by the magic of my god. Power you held as leader of twilight will never return. Already he has descended and be been reborn in the world. As long as my master Ganon survives, he will resurrect me without cease. Oh. Ah, so creepy. But yeah, um, I don't know. Like, I liked the Lord of the Ring movies, but at the same time, I can't really call it, like, the movies were fairly well done, but I can't really ever say that, like, a movie based on a book is my favorite, because most of them, they just can't really encapsulate the same feeling, which I guess is kind of unfair, but it's also just like, that's just, I don't know, that's how I feel about it. Like, I don't know. Like, I never watched the Hobbit movies, but people are like, they're pretty good for, you know, I guess what they do and for the CGI and all that. But I'm like, I don't know. You can't really shove everything from the books into the... There's no way to do it without making a movie that's like a million years long. The Hobbit movies are gar... Okay. Yeah, I was like... Because I just never... I never watched them, and people don't really talk about them. The Lord of the Rings trilogy, they're like, yeah, the Hobbit movies... The only book adaptation that's worth it is Star... I've seen that one! Stardust is very good. Stardust is... I... I used just a fraction of the power that's in me now. I did that using only a fraction of my ancestor's magic. Yeah. You popped that, man. Yes, now is the time. We must save Zelda. Evil power Zant was wielding. I couldn't take it from him. 
but at least I still have the magic of my ancestors. With it, I can return the cherished power Zelda bestowed upon me. Now, let's go. Princess Zelda is waiting. <clears throat> okay. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 oh. I almost left without getting that dang old heart. Shutter Island. I okay. I've I've wa I've watched Shutter Island, and I did like that. Um, I don't think I've I haven't watched Gone Girl. I have watched Fight Club, but I think the problem with the big problem with Fight Club is the people think that the dude is actually like a good person. It's like no, not he's not like he's. I don't know. I don't even know if anti-hero is a good word. He's just he does a lot of shit. Ganondorf was just using Zant to help him return to the world of light. Because now we know that the true nature of the barrier over Hyrule Castle. He's in Hyrule Castle. I'm sure of it. Princess Zelda is in grave danger. We must return to the world of light and hurry to the castle. Okay, fine. Warp me, please. But yeah, I don't. I, I haven't really watched a lot of stuff. Like I watch, I watch like action movies and kung fu flicks and um. Oh god. Uh. Comedy movies, stuff like that. I don't really watch a lot of like horror because I'm not really into like body horror and stuff like that. And I, I mean, honestly, horror is kind of one of those. I feel like it's one of those dime a dozen categories where some like. Every once in a while, you'll get a really good horror movie, but most of the time, they're just like low budget. Hey, look, the zombies. Like, I'm I'm not a very big zombie enthusiast, partially because they became like it. It was there was just like an oversaturation of zombie shit all the time, and I'm like, I don't care about zombies. Yet. Do other things that are interesting. Okay, so we were heading to the I feel like there's a wolf waiting for me. Yes! The Kakariko! We gotta go talk to that wolf and get a move. I keep checking my phone because I'm supposed to be getting a package today. I'm like, I don't know. It says it's supposed to be here by end of day today, but it's getting kind of late for most shipping services. Mm. Right? Correction, bald on movies like Hachiko, The Bucket List, Ah. Oh. <laughs> I haven't really cried during a lot of, like, I don't really cry a lot. Part of it is the whole just built-in, ah, crying for dudes is bad and dumb. Um, but I'm just not a very emotional person to begin with. So, so it's just one of those things where I'm like, I don't know, I just don't feel it. Like, like I'll get emotional, like, I, I will say uh, when I was watching um, No Way Home, that hit me kind of hard in a couple of places. Ah, oh, this is, very, oof, but in a good way. We meet again. At last, the skills I have to teach you have entered the realm of true secrecy. They are forgotten ways that do not leave our bloodline. 
Among the techniques I shall be teaching you are some that may even endanger you. Do you feel ready to learn these skills? Yeah, like, I was sitting, um, on one side, and one of my other friends was sitting, like, two seats down, and, like, I was tearing up, you know, and, and, and all that. She was full-on sobbing, like, during a lot of the movie, and I was just like, oh. Uh. But yeah, I mean, and I understand it too. I'm just, I'm not somebody, like, I kind of process things a little bit differently. Probably just due to like past life experiences where I'm like, I don't dive with that or don't react the same way to things, which pissed my sister off because I've watched stuff with her, like the notebook, which apparently makes everybody cry. And I was just kind of like, eh. But I mean, a lot of like romance stuff just kind of just like, eh, this isn't really my thing. Yeah, I want to learn these skills. Oh, I am legend. Oh, sh oh no. <laughs> yeah, that was really sad, though. I was just like, man, I don't like stuff where they make you like, I, I don't like games where they make you like kill dogs. I'm like, man. I was testing. Oh, yeah, I have to. Helm splitter. Helm splitter. Credit animes. Oh, I forgot to take the. I know. Right now, don't hesitate. Take the shot! Take the shot! Okay. I don't know. I think the things that move me more are like self-sacrifice type thing and, and other stuff like that, so. Excellent. It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost heart. Very well. My fifth hidden skill is the mortal draw. Let it be hewn into your mind. I think this is the one where you have like one health and you do a the sword are known to many creatures and some have strengthened their guards against shield attacks and back slices. Oh no, or maybe the mortal draw is literally just a straight draw and slash. After such a foe, the mortal draw that I'm about to teach you is most effective. You must sheathe your sword and cast aside the most basic of sword skills, these DL targets. You must wait until your foe is upon you then, before your enemy can see through your ruse, you must quickly draw your blade with A. There's no defense for this. Portal draw deals death. Very well, now try it! Dep oh yeah, no, 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 that, that kind of thing got me too. There were a few scenes in one piece. I know it sounds silly, it's one piece. But there's some really, there's some really, uh, moving scenes. Yeah, but yeah, because the ship had been there for so long. Now you try it, okay. Oh, well, yeah. Is that, yeah. Hmm, that was a pointed strike. But do not forget that this technique leaves your life at risk. The fifth hidden skill, the mortal draw, has been passed on. Uh! Ah! Da, 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 da. There are still two hidden skills for you to learn. Do not neglect your daily sword training between now and the time you come to learn the next. Maybe we need again. Yeah, I was just like, oh man. I mean, I even was like uh, pretty moved at the end of the uh, the thriller bark arc with Zora. I was like, oh man, that's a lot to deal with. Oof. Okay, wait, where does that go? You know, I'm not worried about it. Let's see if there's any more dogs. Music stones. I think I have two more techniques to learn. Wait. Hello, did I already pick you up? You caught an ant. Did I get both the ants? Okay, I already caught a bug like that. Oh, uh, yeah. There are a lot of good scenes. I have both ants. No, I only have one ant. Where's the other? I thought it was on a wall. Oh, no, thanks for the heart. 
Where's your friend? Oh yeah, no. I, I, I have to say his was probably one of my favorite. I mean, they, I feel like they all had pretty good backstories overall. Very good chef, man. Thank you for your service. gonna collect all the bugs, but man, I gotta paint it. Well, if I move it. Money. No, I probably shouldn't be taking money from dead people. Just trying to find this ant. Oh well. Oh, that's what I should do. I should go to Hyrule. Well, I gotta go to Hyrule anyway, but um, I think I got enough souls to get what's his face out of the gold. We first saw Final Fantasy X. <laughs> well, it's okay. I mean, there's nothing wrong with being an emotional person. I'm just on the opposite side of the spectrum, where I, it takes quite a bit to get me, like, to that point. Okay, I was just seeing if I had any. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I need, actually, before I go, I think I need to donate more money. Let's do it. Right back, gotta cook dinner. All right, Beth. Enjoy cooking dinner. I hope it's delicious. What's the bug count so far? Not very much. It's about the same as last time, uh, just early. got less than half. I think, okay, yeah, I still, like, I could not, I don't know where the other ant is. I don't know if it's in Kakariko or if both of them are in the graveyard. 2,000? Okay, sure. Give you, here's all my money. Gee, I, I forgot, it's expensive as hell. But I think he also gives you the magic armor for, like, stupid cheap. I guess I should go talk to him. And he, I, I probably do. I know I need it for that, or it makes that a lot easier. Where is the other Yes, please. Plus, I know I need... I can't remember where I get a second bomb bag, but I know I get more than one. I... Uh, hold forward. Yep. Ow. I swear the ant is, like, somewhere... Something... Well, I thought I saw something in the ruin. I imagine. Yeah, that's why I'm like I'm trying to remember where the hell the other. Maybe it's up top. I, don't know. I honestly might pull up a guide for the bugs because I don't remember exactly where most of them are, and searching for them can be kind of a pain in the butt in a big area. Maybe it's by the. There's just a hill there. Well, eh. You're fine. Just your legs. Only a little broken. 
Eld Inn. 100 rupees per night, including continental breakfast, famed natural hot spring. Free! I can't remember if you need the hot spring water for it. I also realize I have two bottles. I still have that milk. But the other one is filled with pumpkin soup. Oh, okay. Oh. Parkour, I know. Hi. Oh. Good warm soak is just what my muscles need before evening falls, brother. I sell stuff across from the bomb shop at night. I hope to see you there, brother. Yeah, sure. Where the fuck is me? Oh, wait. Excuse me. <clears throat> Hit! jumped out of as a Oh! Oh! Uh, uh. Got him! Damn, look at me, I'm so good at games, I found the bug without even having to... Oh, fuck. has the pill bugs, the village, I got both the ants, the grasshopper, the Okay, so in total, Link can receive two wallets and 1,650 rupees by collecting all 20 Okay, they must have changed it, because I can already hold a thousand. So I think she gives you like a thousand and then two thousand? How old is this? This page was last edited on December 6th, 2020. Hmm, because yeah, I have it says when you give her all the bugs it doubles. Okay, IGN. was about to warp, but I can't do that with all these jokes. Oh yeah, uh, I can totally do the, the, this. Hey, Pona. I think this is the fair on. bugs. <sighs> Greetings, Mr. Chaos. I have come to deliver a letter. There's a letter for you. A three, in fact. Well, my business is concluded. Well, 
least it won't take too long to get across here. Oh no. There we go. I do really like these. So, first one. Can you get up? on my own skill and merit. <clears throat> Another one. Oh, I forget. Okay, no, it's not the north. That's why I fucked up, guys. Um, I keep forgetting, for whatever reason, the Wii U version... I think the, yeah, the Wii and the Wii U version are swapped compared to the GameCube version. So the, the map they're showing on here is the GameCube version's map, which is showing the bug on uh, a different. Can you leave me alone, please? God, there's so many gross birds. Starting to get dark. Maybe it'll become more apparent. Oh, there it is. I need the claw shot to get it. No, don't fly away. Uh. Come here, you. Both beetles. God. Butterfly. So we're just bug hunting, right? I think so. Oh, I see it. Welcome back, RC. Did you, did you make, you made food, right? You're all good, you ate. Hello, butterfly. I think that's the second one. Eat hot chocolate, got into bed, okay. Day fly. I don't think I have either. Oh no, I have one of them. Nailed. Oh, those are in Gordo Desert. Hey, what's going on, Zunder? How goes Pokemon and stuff? Currently catching bugs. Going to your mom's tomorrow, so you gotta be sleeping soon. Oh, okay. Are you going early? Well, I mean, I guess it's... 
it's late for you, so early is a very relative term. Oh, I just saw, yep, there's the day fly that I need. Glad to hear it. Oh, boy. You caught that other day fly. Ba -da -da -da. Day fly is complete. Uh, I'm about to get. What is. Dragonfly. Those guys are in. Oh, doors don't. Oh, warp. Yes, please. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, by the way, RC. I only have one more reading until I'm done with this. I, I uploaded the tenth video. Well, I guess 11th, if you consider the foreword. Um, yeah. Very soon. Be able to start up on another book. Keep a schedule. Getting us at 1.30, but you need to grab a shower and do your hair. Oh, no, I gotcha. Makes sense. I wanna be prepared. Okay. Yeah. Be like, eh. Eh, well, whoop. Sorry, Zorus. Oh, there it is. Hanging out. Wow, how did I how did I miss these things? Guess I can't. Gotcha! Haha! <laughs> Never would have expected me to be a wolf. There's a whole other area on the map that I never uh, freaking went to. Man. Man. There we go, I guess. Because you'll actually be leaving. Oh, okay. What, does that not always happen? <laughs> here. Oh yeah, there's something down there. I think I still have water bombs. <laughs> oh, I'm also dying. Thank you. Oh, it's just full of money. Oh, there, wow. God, how did I miss that? That's literally right there. Guys, I'm bad at catching bugs, I'm sorry. Hi, Pop, hi, Pop. Hello? Could you come up here? Please, a little closer, a little, uh, uh, little closer. Under head Pokemon if you're taking books like that. Oh, okay, I got you. Custom. Sorry, but we're temporarily closed. Okay, well, bye. Oh, cool! See what happens when you tell me you're closed? Uh, shit gets real, real fast. That scream, though. Hi. I did it. I killed him. You're in mid turning your PC off. Where'd she go? Um, I think she went to water uh, the plants.
hot fucking fuel. Sorry, I'm waiting because I, I ordered a phone. And it was like, oh, you should get it by today. It The last update was two days ago in California. And now it finally gave me the thing where it's like, it's delayed. I'm like, fucking seriously? Google? So, wow, I have no idea when I'm going to get that. That's cool. Oh, that scared me. Who are you? I'll try to stick around. All right. I figure it shouldn't be longer than maybe 10 or 15 minutes. You know, I bet that's a fucking email where they're like, oh, by the way. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. That's another thing. Uh, just so you guys know, I did order a... Uh, it's okay. I haven't either. I did, I did get into chat with her earlier because... Um, the chocolates that I sent her finally to her. I bought her a, a tin of, well, I call it a tin. It's like a plastic case of the, the quality street ones because you told me that they were good. How can you keep your cool fighting monsters like that? Uh, wow, you, uh, wow, what a champ you are. <laughs> well, what are we standing around John? Come on inside. Yeah, quality street. And she was like, oh, that's based in... Camden or Cam come? He's like, that's a place I'd like to visit. Golly, talk about scary. I thought I was done for. Things have been getting pretty crazy around here, I tell you. So thanks for earlier. My name's Isa. I rent boats here. Well, I used to rent boats here, but then we had a rock fall and it jammed the river up. Yeah, I sure could use a helpful guy around at times like this. Yep. A handy guy would sure be a big help around. Really? Yeah, I'll help out. Man, she's super tough. You're a lifesaver. Well, do you think you could do something about that rock? I'll give you some bombs and arrows, so just put them together and shoot bomb arrows at that thing. Oh, wait, I think she's the one that gives me the bag. Why did I pause? What did, why is it pause? Because it was like, hey. Okay. Amazon delivery sent to your mom's for car so you don't miss them. Oh, that's good. Yes. Yeah. You did it. Well, my gal tells me there are still some rocks blocking the way along the river. And you should take care of those too. Here's the boat. Hop in. I remember this part. Now, it's a teensy bit dangerous downriver here, so uh, don't leave the boat, okay? One of our part timers is waiting down there, so you can get the details from her. And when you're done, you can keep that bomb bag and everything in it as a token of my appreciation. We'll be seeing ya. Oh, okay. This is the... I forgot that she she's the one that gives me another bomb bag. I guess it's a good thing I did. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh God. Oh, there's rocks. Oh, that's not rocks. That's wood. Oh, God. We're fine. Good at boats. Ah, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of annoying because that's too like. Granted, this thing's being sent by FedEx, but I do. It's a, a phone, and I'd rather get it sooner than later. Like the phone I have is fine. I'll, I'll probably see if I can like trade it in for like credit uh, with the carrier I have now. Um, but the other thing is, my mom bought me something on Amazon, and that's like, nobody knows where the hell that is. Uh, that was the thing I was telling you about the other day, where I was like, just, just get a refund. But she's, I think she's waiting like another week to see. It. Yeah, I did, Pat. It, that was like emergency. I need a phone because I, my other phone was like literally falling apart. Um, which is this, which is a Pixel 2. Um, is that the one that just disappeared? Oh, uh, yeah. Also, welcome. I hope that siege is going good. Um, 
But yeah, but I wanted, I, I want to upgrade to a, a Google Pixel 5, which is, you know, a few generations later, because uh, I was like, I want to have a phone with like a really good camera and stuff like that, so I can do more vlogging and things. Because the camera on this is all right, but it's definitely, it's still an older phone. It's still better than my other phone, but. So yeah, I, I was planning on upgrading once I was more financially stable, and now that I'm at that point, I'm like, why not? Yeah, 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 this, this is, uh, no, this is what my mom got me off my wish. The other thing she got me is she bought me, um, she, uh, she apparently got me Super Mario, or not Super, like Mario Party um, All-Stars, but it's apparently, oh, I, I forget, I just have bomb errors for it. but apparently it's, it, it, like Amazon doesn't know where the delivery is at right now, and I think it was it was out for delivery since the 27th of December, or it, that's when it was shipped. I need to get a new phone too. Yeah, I figured I might as well like upgrade. I can't remember how to actually do this very good. Jesus, I'm all over. The but yeah, so I told her she she should probably just get a refund. I felt kind of bad because she's like, but it's your Christmas present. I'm like, I understand that, Mom. But like, if we don't know where it's at, it's better if you get your money back. You know? Hi, Anna. See, you have a hoodie? But yeah, so that's why I was like, I haven't had this phone for very long, but that just means that I can, because I've been using Google Fi and I can probably trade it in for like credit towards my bill and all that after I uh, figure out the next phone, whenever that shows up, because it's just, I hate when shipments say delayed because they might as well just say fuck you because who knows how long it's going to take, you know, for it to show up. So yeah, I'm just like, man, whatever. Get tired of shit. But I do have an order coming in tomorrow from Amazon that is um, like one of those little label mics because when I get back into cooking screens, I kind of want to use that so I can, you know, move around the kitchen without losing uh, voice quality or like sound quality and all. It's not wireless, but I assume if I'm in a kitchen, I'm not going to be moving around that, or I'm not, I, I, I'm not going to be moving out of range of how long the wire is. I saw that. Well, you know, did you guys know that I have DMs that you can, if you can invite me? I saw you guys in there, and then RC told me, and I was like, oh, okay. And then I just did my own thing. I'm not going to jump in there. Oh, and another thing. I don't suppose she promised you anything special for doing this, did she? Just that bomb bag, right? Yeah, she tends to bribe people with whatever, whatever's lying around. So stingy, really. It's all right. I'll let her know you kept it when I get back. I know nobody asks me. I swear to God. <laughs> I always tell you guys, I'm like, yeah, it's whatever. And then it never happens. A little secret for you there. Yeah, no, that's a, a lot of where the ride ones under went to sleep. Oh, uh, oh no, that's to get back to. Okay, bye. I don't want to deal with you. Um, I got it. Yep, that's not what I wanted to do. You know, you kept pushing it off. I have. It's because I don't play Phasmo very often. And usually when I do, it's just with Dez because Dez initiates. Like, I don't mind playing things with people. I just, most of the time, I just don't because I I have no reason to play Phasmo. Uh, I 
but it's fine. Ladybug, I got those at the lady. I'm not, well, you know what, never mind. We can talk about that more often. A couple of things that we planned on doing that have never happened, but. Ladybug, grasshopper. I have one of the grasshopper. Where's the other grasshopper? Elden Pro What? Grab that big back I don't know where the hell I am. Can I warp here? Okay, I gotta go to this Well There is so large. one which I think is just right here yeah for another see that's that's the other thing I'm gonna tell you guys right now I enjoy hanging out with you but I cannot play game especially like multiplayer games I cannot play them that long the only reason why I can play Final Fantasy 14 for so long is because I can fuck off and do my own thing like I also don't like feeling like I have to like portion out um, time like or Kind of, I don't know, fight for time with some people. Which is why if I see you in a chat with other people, I'm not gonna join. Because I'm like, that's your time with them. I'm on the wrong fucking side of the map! Okay, I was on the wrong. I keep forgetting that the guide here is showing the GameCube version, and I'm not on the GameCube version. Stop! Oh, it, uh. oh, thanks for the arrow. No! I can't! It's too bright! Oh! I have another bomb bag. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> I said, uh, well, I'm not gonna make you play like Fortnite or anything like that. But it's the thing is, the other thing you guys have to remember about me is I feel like I'm fucking bothering you if I like talk to you about something more than once. So that's why a lot of times, like, it's bad. It's hard for me to make plans about stuff like that. So I'm gonna get angry. I'm getting angry. At this fucking no, I got the grass. Wow, I took a lot of damage just doing that dumb bullshit.
No, you do bother me all the time, but not with like game stuff. I mean, I I generally try to message people daily if possible. Whether that that means we can actually do something is uh, it, like up to whatever, but I'm usually pretty good about that at least. Mantis, there's. I never reply, you bother me. I mean, this is true. Usually, I don't reply just because I'm like on the road or something. Okay, I gotta go. I guess this is the fastest way. <laughs> yeah. Well, at the same time, like I said, I'm just... I'm not too keen on joining if it's a lot of... Even if it's just you and Oreo. Like, ah. Uh, it just feels weird. Because I'm not a part of the game. I'm just existing. You can't do that, she's too short. No, that's that's not true. It's all about Lesbury. Um Oh yeah! This is the one I wait. Um, and it's cast. I, I mean, I don't know. We'll have to figure out a time that's good for like everybody. You know that I'm pretty much, as long as I'm not streaming, I'm usually pretty good with whatever. Like, I was hanging out with Dez today, and then I hung out a bit with Cat, and then I started streaming. But, like, aside from that, where the f oh, wait. This is the right. I hear it. I see you. No, you, you can't hide from me, please. No. Okay, got it. I think I already installed it on my computer. Yeah, I should have. I usually install it. I don't know. I mean, I'll work on that more as well. It's just... Most of the people that I talk... Like... Like, Dez has joined, like, Speak Time Chat a few times, but a lot of the people that I talk to prefer, like, one-to-one -one chats, which is why me getting into group chats is just kind of weird. I'm like, oh, okay. And I know that's the whole point of voice chats, is to just hang out and chill with people. But... Did you get... No! Arcee's not angry about it. At least she wasn't angry at you about it. Well, she wasn't angry at me. RC would usually tell you if she was angry. RC has a way of telling you that she's angry. Yeah. Wait! The goop! Oh, I could scoop the goop, but I don't want to scoop the goop. Look at this goop! Where's that bug? Wait. I think I saw it shine through the wall? I did! <laughs> I mean, that's pretty cheap for a game. Which game? use the word wait which word oh was it the word we're talking about with the you can't say it something about wait the f wait what f oh that word yeah no fuck that you're not allowed to use that word i know exactly which word she's talking about. i know i've seen evidence that that word is untrue Uh, 
Oh, and that, ah, uh, that is really cheap because I think 60 pesos is only like $3, isn't it? Um, I believe it was like five pounds or six pounds, which would be the equivalent of like, I don't know. I, I don't have the, I don't have it all up in my head, but yeah. Well, Spanish shares a lot of similarities with uh, Italian and such, so thankfully that makes it a lot easier. Oh, hello. What's here? Never mind, I thought that something would be in that ring. It was not. Okay, guys, look, look, we're so close. I only need four more bugs. Um, Phasma. Oh, sorry, five. I need the female phasma. Is... A lot of things. Uh, oh. I know some things. Not, not, not. Where, th where is that bridge? Oh wait, is that that bridge? It is that bridge. Okay, back over to that side. That's where the other fastnet is. I don't want to transfer. Oh, okay, well I guess I do. No, no things. You know things. You know a whole lot about various uh, crime dramas. Yeah. Eh. Okay. Oh, yeah, you don't owe me anything for that. Sorry, I had, there's still some things that I don't 100% understand it to me. So I had to look that up, but no, you don't. It's like fucking yesterday, um, I bought some sushi for Fo, and Fo was like, how can I pay you back? And I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? I got stuff like that. Okay. Where the hell is this phasma? Oh, it's. Oh. Yeah, exactly. So that's your. Yeah, exactly. We make. Wait. Did we make a deal? I thought I just kind of did it. Like I always do. You know, I talk a lot about you guys listening to me, but I also do not listen to you guys when it comes to that kind of stuff, because I'm just like, nope, I'm doing this. Sorry. Cat's like, I don't really need any more candy. What do I do? I buy her more candy. But it's okay, she can stretch it out. Oh, the f over there, the bug. Okay, well take the money that you would need, that you owed me, and put it into savings towards more computer stuff. That's how you can pay me back. Yes. Well, I don't know. She, uh, well, that's not where I have to. Oh no, where am I? Oh, I'm just in the bridge again. Okay, I gotta figure out how to get to... Go in the cave? Oh, I see the bug! I don't even have to go in the cave. I just gotta go to the bug. Discount. Wow! That's, that's not much of a discount. Oh, yeah. No, no NFT. Please don't. That's like being like, okay, well, uh... Put it into... Insert Bitcoin of choice, or I should say cryptocurrency. Yeah, it's it's kind of hard to explain. Fast mid. I don't know. I don't want to. Do I think that's both the phasmids now. Okay, now all we need is Lady Pillbug. Lady Snail and um 
whatever the hell this is. This is over in, oh, it's in Kakariko. Oh, Kakariko. Lord. You want Dogecoins? Beer at my, okay, tell her we said hello. And I hope that she's well. That's cack. Yeah, pump, dump, yeah. Um, wait, what? Oh yeah, that is really awkward. <laughs> well... I guess the fat... Oh boy. Okay, sorry. Yeah, I just saw that. As a moderator, I guess. <clears throat> Let's see. There is. There's emails in the two. Hello again, Beth. What did you end up making for dinner? I'm currently collecting bugs for money. Like Animal Crossing. Okay, got the bug. Next bug. The other snail. Oh. The females inside the Temple of Time? They put it inside a goddamn dungeon? Fuck these bugs. Don't put it inside a dungeon. That's not that's not kosher at all. To the sacred grove we go. You made tortellini while cooking for the week, and you might have messed up your kitchen. Oh no! Well, it's okay. That's you know what? That's a problem for future Beth. Unless you already took care of it, in which case you did you did good job. But yeah. How much man? Yeah. You know, Beth and me were talking about that earlier, because I was saying when I get into a new place, I want to start cooking again. And and Beth was like, what are you going to cook first? And I was like, you know what? Probably bread. And then I'm going to dig into, like, the bajillion recipes uh, in the book that Kat got. Needs to cool down. Oh, this is true. Yeah, please don't burn yourself. Oh, yeah. Um, go into the temple, please. I just, I just Discord put in the Not Safe Work channel. It's very good. Okay, I need to break a pot. Where is the pot? That in the end. Pot. Oh no, it's not in a pot, it's just hanging out. I hear it. It's on the other side. Aha! Look at that snail. Forgot that if you leave milk on the stove. Oh no! Yeah! Oh yeah, yeah. I hate that. It happens when I'm like, uh, God, when I'm boiling potatoes, because, you know, the starch kind of like froths up, and yeah, you. I was like, I, I've had plenty of times where I'm like, I'm just gonna run to my room and check something really quick. And then I get back and I can hear the water like 
splashing down the side, and I'm like, whoops. Sorry. I can't remember if there's anything back there. Did I already get one? Nothing. It's just, that's nothing. Okay. okay. Maybe there's something. Okay. Ah, ha, ha. Yeah, there's a room. Did I go back here? I did. Never mind. I, I doubted myself from the past. Good time, so you forgot. Yeah, no, I got you. That reminds me, I have some potatoes that I actually need to throw away because I bought them before I even went to Houston for Christmas and all that. And it is currently to the point where they're probably not so great anymore. Wait, everywhere because it's a little... Yeah, exactly. Five minutes later, everything's covered in white. Exactly. That's why I always rinse out the pots that I made potatoes in because I know that if I leave it, it'll just get that white film all over. Stag beetle, that's what I'm missing. That's in... Uh, 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 oh, this one. That's why is everything so far away? Hey, well, I guess we'll just go to castle. Oh. Ash potatoes, sausages, onions, mushrooms. Oh, <laughs> really fighting your rice cooker. Oh, God, I want some good sausage. I should really go to the butchers here because they have like they have this garlic sausage that i fucking love and it doesn't take too long to prepare because it's already cooked um i love garlic sausage. it's just so good. like brats oh that's the second mess well uh, okay at least one thing at a time we, we, we know what battle we're fighting so it's okay they're able to find really I don't know. You know, I like mushrooms prepared in a variety of ways. Like stuffed mushrooms, fried mushrooms, um, sauteed mushrooms for like steak and stuff, or having them in like soup or other things. I don't know. I just, I really like them. I don't know what it is. It's just like the weird flavor. Yeah. Like the texture doesn't bother me, which is weird because I'm somebody who, like, if I have a problem with food, it's less about flavor and it's more about the texture. Like, I like eggplant, but I also don't like eggplant because it's kind of like slimy. And I like okra, but only when it's fried. I mean, part of the thing is my mom never made us eat okra because she hated it. So, so I never really experienced it until later in life. And I was like, fried okra is okay because it's crunchy. But if it was slimy, I'd be like, like, I've had raw oysters before. Not really a fan. Not a fan. You've never, really? I mean, it's not so bad. It's not something I go out of my way to eat. Especially since I usually just get it from this like fried chicken place because they, they sell it fried. Uh, but apparently it's also used in gumbo. But I've, I don't know, any gumbo I've had, I don't know if it had okra in it or if it was just in such small like parts that I didn't know. Oh, I might actually be below. Oh, yeah, I think I'm supposed to. It's too tall. Yeah, okay, I can see it shining through the wall. Go. My unpopular opinion is Brussels sprouts are delicious. I love Brussels sprouts, actually. My mom never made us eat them. But, like, I just like them simply, like, sauteed in butter with, like, some salt and pepper. I've got no issue with them. I, I feel like if they're prepared co correctly, they taste really good. Yeah, yeah, crunchy, exactly. Not boiled, no. Boiling them makes them not fun. Not a fun texture experience. But yeah, like pan fried, good shit. Hello, Tech Tight. Good stuff. Yeah. Good, good. 
And I, I decided to think, like, I need to prepare a lot more, like, stuff with fresh ingredients. Because I never really got a lot here because I didn't cook very often. So it was, like, a waste to get, um, like, fresh veggies and stuff. Because I never use them fast enough. Like, even, like, lettuce. Um, like, I like romaine lettuce. But if I get, like, the three heads of lettuce, I just can't eat it fast enough before it starts getting, like, really wilted. Oh, I bet this is a piece of art. Oh, God. Oh, there's a lot. Whoa. Guys, we just found puzzle dungeon thing, I guess. You guys ready for puzzles? <laughs> so, this is going to work. <laughs> and then... <laughs> We're gonna come back around here. We're gonna push this one. I can't. Ah, uh, see. And that block is gonna stay there, but we're gonna push the other block into that block and therefore finish the puzzle. Yes. Oh, easy. Elementary, as it were. Here we are. that open why did that open a gate as well maybe it's just I got it. 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 <laughs> that. Then we just bring it around the whole way, and then we push it up, and it almost switches. See? Do that in six moves or less, Layton. <laughs> Oh, there were two sets of gates. Okay, I was like, why did it make a noise? Two gates. Okay, now we're here. Okay. <laughs> this day started out like any other day. just had a fucking fantastic idea. Are you guys ready for this? Are you fucking ready for this? <laughs> yeah, wait. Actually, is this a good idea? I don't know, actually know if it's... <laughs> So far, so good. <laughs> now we're... Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. 
Uh. I'm trying to finish the hat, leaving pics in Discord now. Yeah! Hell yeah. Yeah. May or may not actually be good. Oh, no, no, no. Guys, I'm so smart. And then you push this down. You push the other one down. And then you push it up. It down and then up. And then it's going to land on the switch. Wow. Never doubt me again when it comes to pushing big blocks on ice. His heart, probably, for all my troubles. Yeah! We got five! Heart container! Yeah, look at all them hearts. Now I'm healed. Alright, very good. I feel like I probably don't need that boy on anymore. That. Very good. Okay. Um. Mail is in the. Oh, wait. I got. Oh, wait. That's everybody. Everybody. Okay. Time to go make a whole shit ton of money. Let's go talk to Agatha. Yes. Hey! Alinka, how are you doing? Happy New Year's to you. I'm not sure if you saw my message. Hola. Uh, Alinka is a, a very, a very cool cosplayer. That I know. Uh, I hope that you're well. I hope you enjoyed your vacation. I don't know if you're still on vacation. Yeah, no, it's good to see you too. been following her for a while on I think if you check out her channel there should be a link on there or I could always find she's done a lot of League cosplay which it's funny because I'm not a huge fan of League of Legends but I like they do have some really cool outfits and a lot of cosplayers do a good job with it. I'm like you know what that's not so but yeah. You love the characters. I know, yeah. I still need to watch, um... Oh gosh. Uh, uh, the... My god, what is the show called? I already forgot. Because I heard the animation is very, very good. Characters. Arcane! That's what it's... Sorry, everybody. I don't know words. But yeah, I need to watch um, Arcane. Still haven't seen it. Plus, I always love seeing your... The outfits and stuff that you make. Yeah, I brought a lot of bugs. In. And I wish I didn't have to give these to her one at a time. This is a lot of bugs. Okay, little ant. Thanks for the 50 rupees. Gonna be a lot of turn again. Therapist charge me with that. No! Oh no! Are are you? Wait, are you going to them soon? Like, is it just, do you usually, like, do you have, like, an agreement for payment and... 
Because I thought it was usually like, you paid when you went, type of thing. It's for the test from last year, but they said they sent- Oh no, and they- Oh no. Oh jeez. Yeah, it, like, man. It really sucks when they do that and you're just like, Hey, I- I mean, I knew I had to pay you, but I like to know exactly when that's happening. Boy. Are you gonna be okay? I know you said things were gonna be a little weird going into the year just because you've been sick a lot. Like, they're gonna have to wait a bit. Okay. Yeah, butterfly, rupees, thanks. I really wish I had been doing this all along the way. Alrighty, they just have to go to your- Okay, I got you. You don't want to be wrapped up in that powder. I might have to leave because I'm gonna hit my limit of rupees soon, and I need to give more to Mallow, so start up Mallow. Mode. About your sister rang. It's like one in the morning. What is your sister ringing you about? Oh, you get a stamp from her. Okay. For the halfway point, I guess. Her body spray has... Wait, it burnt? What? what uh, body, are you talking about like shaving bodies? Did she leave it on too long? Like Nair or something like that? Oh, de deodorant? Oh, jeez. What? Oh. It, it, was it like a reaction? Oh, uh, that's... 100 or... Okay, well, I'm gonna leave for now because I'm... I know you're gonna be mad. You're gonna be like... Oh, wait, she doesn't say it now. Okay, well, I'll be back. You don't know? That is weird. Yeah. Well, hopefully she's okay. Because I know there's people who have gotten burnt from like, you know, like hair removal sprays, because technically you're not supposed to have those on your skin for longer than a specified amount of time, but deodorant. Oh no, and so the conversation went on a lot longer than it needed to, uh huh. You know, that's just kind of how it goes. Maybe, where am I going? Oh, I like the starter hat and ribbon. Oh, it's gonna have. You didn't tell me this hat was gonna have ears, Beth, with little bells on them. Oh, come uh. Purple is very good. Purple is a green. No, 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 no. She was meaning to say burnt. Yeah, of course. Um, but brunt is also something, like, if you say you took the brunt of something, it, it means that you took, like, a lot of it. Like, 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 let me put it into example. Like, if you got into a bad car, fucking where is this child? Just go away, I'm trying to transform. Don't look at me, I'm naked. But, um, like, it, it's kind of like if you're playing a game and somebody's playing, like, a tank and they take the brunt of the damage because they're taking more. That kind of thing. 
But she she meant birds. It was just the miss. Man, tonight's been a good night. So many good. I'm really glad that that things are going well for you, uh, Palinka. By the way, man, it's so weird to. I feel like I've known most of these people in chat for at least a year or more. It doesn't feel like in English right now. It's like ammo. Wait, how like? Uh, well, well, like if, yeah, like it's kind of like I don't know. I don't know if you played Overwatch, but if you play as like a tanky character, you're taking the brunt of the damage so everybody else can live. Usually. Usually. What am I doing? Malamart. I have to go give him money. I'm sorry, everybody. My mind is everywhere. I'm thinking about, like, cool people and cosplays and witch hats and food. Oh, yeah, you could say that, too. Eh, that would probably just make you more greedy than anything else. Okay, um... Yeah, okay, time to go milk more money out of that nice bug woman. All right, but yeah. If you don't mind me asking, but is this is this going to be something you use in um, your campaign, or is it just something you kind of want to make? It's fun. Maybe you think you're pointing out? No, 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 well, no. I mean, it, it's. It's okay to ask about that stuff, especially if it's a word that you just, if you aren't sure if it's actually a word or not, like, because I'd rather you learn than just be like, I don't know, but I'm too afraid to ask. I gotta work. Because you never phrase it in a way that sounds like you're, like, making fun of something. Her campaign? Oh, no, but I was asking you if the hat you were making, if you were just kind of doing it just for fun as like a hobby thing, or if you if it was something that was going to be used later on. Oh, it's for a costume thing? Okay. Have more bugs. Yes. Have the stag beetle. I am giving her all the bugs. She's gonna be so happy. So full of bugs. Hi. Yeah. Uh. Well, I can't wait to see what it what it ends up being for. I mean, you've done some pretty cool stuff in the past. I will say, I actually, I really like having my hair uh, this short. Well, um, I might let it grow out a little bit longer, but I am kind of digging the look. 
I probably won't have it grow out too long. Maybe I can finally do what I keep saying I'm gonna do and get like different wigs and stuff for stream and stuff. Because why the fuck not? I'm just very bad at actually committing to that. Plus, it'll probably help when I have my own place and closet and I can like figure out. I'm gonna try uh, and iron the thing. Oh, well, as long as it's at a low temperature, it should be fine. I'm not sure what material the hat's made out of. Well, thank you. I, a lot of people have said that. I'm like, thanks, because when I cut it at first, it was just very short, and I'm like, I don't know. But, you know, it's it's the usual kind of, like, I guess, body dysmorphia type thing where you're used to seeing yourself one way, and when there's, like, a fairly big change, you're just like, oh, I don't know if I like this. But it's it's really grown on me. No pun intended. And honestly, it's it's kind of nice not having to worry about my hair taking a long time to dry and all that. Okay, oh guys, the final bug. One bug left. All the bugs! They look so happy. Yeah, I'm a brave knight. Please accept this declaration of honorable citizenship and the memento that goes along with it. A giant! Okay, now you can all, they changed it because it used to be like 500 and 1,000 rupees or 600 and 1,000. Now it's 1,000 and 2,000. That's a lot of money. If you ever feel like talking to the bugs again, you know where to go. Thanks. Okay guys, I got the biggest wallet. Now I can help. Mallow fulfill his dream of taking over the the mark here. You know, I was like, we might finish this tonight, but I am doing a lot of, like, just extra content now. So, I might actually completely finish this game later on. Like, I don't know, maybe I can go ahead and get the ball. I'd need at least... How many hearts do I have? Five, 25 pieces of heart. That's a lot of pieces of heart. I don't know if I'm gonna get all the pieces. Uh, what game is next after this? I think I'll finally play, I keep saying it. I think I'm finally, for realsies, gonna play Dragon Quest XI. Because I want to play it. And I have it on Xbox Game Pass. And I really need to play more stuff on my Game Pass because I need to like make it worth it, honestly. Uh, I think I might do more YouTube videos of playing like random Xbox uh, Game Pass games. Just because I might as well. I mean, uh, but tomorrow, it is Saturday, and, um, oh god, I put the cookbook on top of it, and, oh yeah, Zunder, I got this, so I forgot, I should have told you earlier, so, because I feel like you wanted to start the game to kind of, like, play it alongside, but, or did you play Ace Attorney Chronicles back in the day? I can't remember. But anyway, I'm gonna start on this, now that I have the Ace Attorney Chronicles. If, if Zunder is still here. Oh no, okay. Not yet. Yeah, I just wasn't sure if you played the originals. But I think you said that you were waiting because you you knew, or you were pretty sure that after the remaster of the originals, they were gonna do it, right? Whoa, whoa, I only need to give 134. A lot. There's also outlying games. There's, I feel like there's like, like 15 or 16 total at this point. Like in the main series, there's only six. But then there's the Edgeworth one, or two Edgeworth, I don't know. 
And then there's the Great Ace Attorney Chronicles. And then there's probably some other ones that I don't know. Today marks the day that another legendary establishment is born. You should travel to Castletown. Thank you for your cooperation, brother. I got all the bugs. Out of me now. Winning. But yeah, there's a bunch of them. And they're fairly long. Like, Jesus Christ. Fucking. Ooh. Like, Spirit of Justice just felt like it lasted forever. Not even gonna lie. A beer more than I mean if you want I'm not gonna stop you I thought you didn't like beer no I'm not really a huge fan of most beer like all of like the regular draft beers you'd get here they uh, to me they all kind of just taste like varying amounts of piss sorry beer makers a lot of your beer tastes like shit at least American beer I mean, if you want to try, I'm not, I'm not going to stop you. Well, I forget. The drinking age is 18 in Mexico, right? Or is it 21? Is your... I mean, I guess if you're at home, it doesn't matter right away. You want to eat chips with lemon and salsa? Bag? I mean, if you want to, right. 18, okay. I mean, you're old enough. You are a responsible adult. Anna, you can do what you please, as long as you're careful about it. Okay, um, what am I doing? Got the bugs. Guess I should go to Castle Town. Hello. Who are you? Oh, you're yeah. just trying to. So I predicted that you would come, my brother. Tell me, my brother, did you not see a young Goron in Castletown? He has yet to come back, even though they say the Eastgate Bridge is fixed. Perhaps you could look in. Another. I th oh yeah, I remember now. I think I have to give hot spring juice to the bro trying to break the boulder. That makes him stronger? Yeah, <laughs> well... I mean, true. I don't know. Just, just tell your dad that you'll be careful. I mean, and you're at home, right? I think if he, if you're at home and he's with you, it shouldn't be as, as big of a deal. Sorry, father. Mm, drink that delicious soup. God, he really chugged it. It will be playing lot. I don't know how long it takes. I don't know if warping cools it off immediately. Yes, he's here. Tell him I said hello and I'm sorry. <laughs> So it should, I mean, and you're, you're a smart girl. I mean, you, you know better than to like get like wasted and like take off somewhere or something. No driving, definitely. Although I, I figure at this point in the night, you don't really have any place to go. Why is he angry? <laughs> Why is he angry? Don't be angry, dad. <laughs> Just want a little. He'll drink one and he'll sleep. Okay. That's perfectly. 
I don't want any more letters from you, bro. I just want to give this man the, some hot spring water. Oh, it's Malomar. Then we're going to, yeah, true, to help absorb it a little. I've been drinking um, a little bit each night, actually, because um, apparently for New Year's, they bought a, my roommate's parents bought like a ass ton of wine coolers. And they they were like, if you want any, go ahead. So each night with dinner, I've just had like a wine, cooler, which does literally nothing to me, but they taste pretty good. So I'm like, eh, why not? Yeah, apples, apples are good. Oh, everybody's got Malomart bags now. I also still have like that, this, this like whole bottle of vodka because I barely drink vodka. A lot of hard liquor. Just because I'm not, I don't know, it's nice to be tipsy, but I'm usually not like drunk. Maybe I'll drink some tomorrow. Every time they say objection, take a shot. Actually, don't do that. that's a bad idea. You drink red wine on New Year's Eve and you sleep like eight hours and oh no, yeah. That'll do it. That worked for you. Aw. Yeah, exactly. Take a look at these rocks. Amazing. Was there a landslide or something? What are you doing here anyway, brother? You're trying to pass through here? If I drank some hot spring water, it might give me the strength to break through a big rock fall like this. Brother, if you find some hot spring water, you should come see me again. I have it. What the fuck, Link? Like this guy is like, did you just, did you just fucking, did you just pour a bottle of hot water on me? I had it. Maybe it got cold. Maybe warping makes it cold. Thank Jello Vot. Yeah, Jello shots are pretty cool. I would, man. Okay, this is gonna sound weird, but I would love to go to a hot spring with you. And I'm not just saying that because of oh, oh, hot spring episodes, look at all the ladies, but just because I've never been to an actual straight up hot spring. Even when I went to Japan, we didn't go because, you know, COVID stuff was going on at that point. So a lot of places were closed. Why have you never used that? I'd like to see these. There's more than one? I was never told of this. I mean, now that you need to tell me whatever you can do. But I am highly interested. Uh, yeah, I know. That's, that's one of the big reasons why I want to go to Houston, because at least, like, the gulf isn't the ocean, but the gulf is still more than zero bodies of water. So, you know. Okay, so that bridge is fixed. Okay, so. Uh, hot spring water twilight. How long does it stay warm? Oh, Jesus. I didn't have to pay 2,000 rupees. I fucked up. Oh, so I can buy the hot spring water. Damn, guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I I apparently could have saved myself a whole lot of money. Yeah, it, yeah. we've talked about this before. It, it makes her father not so happy. You don't like the ocean? Well... I would like to see those at some point. So I hope that things get bigger.
Okay, where who sells hot spring water? Oh bread. Other ones that cover a little more. So did you wear to bake him eat? <laughs> or rather, you don't look like you came here to buy meat. And now, well I love meat. Okay, I can't remember where I can buy hot. Uh, you kind of UK you can use it. Hot tub stream. I guess I gotta wait a day. So much stuff. I got sidetracked. I want to check. Yeah, no, no, no. I checked for you. I already said no kitchen airport. Ah. It's okay. Like technically, my roommate uh, has like a hot tub type bath, but I feel really weird. Like ever, I've never used it because I don't know. It's just one of the things. It's attached to the master bath or master bedroom, so it's just kind of like, even if he's not home, I feel really weird. Like, I feel really weird trying to. Use Time to finish this hat. You can do it! Just make sure to take little breaks for your hands or, or massage them. You need to get you one of those little, like, the, those little, uh, I don't know. Do they make, like, little basins where you put your hands in to... I know they make foot massagers. I don't know about hand massagers. That's probably it. Ah, I do not feel like doing a thing. Now the bridge is fixed, but my body feels terrible. I just cannot go look for stuff to sell. You know, all I really need is to shower myself with some piping hot spring water to get back to feeling normal. Okay, I think that now I can go to Kakariko and talk to your guy. What if I warp literally three feet away? Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Well, I mean, Beth's from Spain, which is technically around the same area as all the other fancy places, so Beth is fancy. Oopsie! I'm still a wolf, I'm sorry! <laughs> Whoopsie! Well, now I can change back because nobody's a rural. <laughs> yeah. Beth is from Spain. Beth knows Spanish. Very well. I do not know Spanish as well as Beth, brother. But I do my best. I need to go to bed. Mm. 
I'm not sure what that is. Can I chat with her in Spanish? Um, yeah, well, yeah. I mean, I don't think Beth would mind. Kind of like talk with Fo and... Although, I think they're currently working on their hat right now. So they might not be able to respond. They probably have me uh, put up in the back. Okay, what? There's so many bottles. Can I stay the... Do I talk to you to stay the night? Zor boy said you gave him courage. I guess that boy is his name. Yeah, just, uh, he was a successor to Zor throne, so he had to go back to his home. He's glad that thanks to you is healed. Okay. Yeah, everybody's better. Alice went with the people. He thought I could use this. I could Some things I yeah, no. I mean I I don't think they would mind at all. Uh, Halinka that was in here earlier. She is also a Spanish speaker. Um, out of everybody that I know, she probably knows the least amount of English, which is one of the reasons why I'm trying to be better at learning Spanish, so converse better with people. But yeah. yeah, I think I'm gonna finish up soon. But I was trying to figure out this whole bridge situation, but we can probably, probably. I gotta pack my uh, my books up. Well, so like manga and stuff, because I I have a pretty decent sized box that I got from an Amazon shipment earlier. See the young Goron in Castle Town? I'm far sighted in all things, brother. I'm sure he's hanging his head somewhere around the East Gate right at the moment. Here's the plan: I will prepare some hot spring water, and you will douse that young one to revitalize him. I'll do it. Okay, let's do this. This will be my last act of the night. So I'm going to take this barrel of hot spring water. Yeah, I know it's extra late. Douse him in the mallow mart waters. That's having fun. She's... Weavers? Like... One of those things where I'm always like, I prefer if you go to bed at a decent hour, but also if you're having a good day. Plus, I do enjoy talking. Maybe I'm not the best at this. Uh, get away from me, bird! I gotta throw this water on this dude! Oh boy, more levers. No way! <laughs> I'm busy! Oh god! Uh. Oh. Okay. Is that some Kakariko hot spring water you have there, brother? Pour it on me, I'm sure it would restore my strength. Look at him. I feel rejuvenated. That smell, that heat, it is the spring water from back home. Well, I'm gonna get back to work and open up the shop. Oh, the noises. I mean, I can't say anything either, because I also messaged that. But... Don't ask how that barrel is not moving. Oh, he also gives a piece of heart. Yes. Da, 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 da. That hot spring water and give it to the Goron at the south gate. Oh, hello. I didn't know that you guys were inside. Oh, yeah, they were inside this area last time, too.
through. <clears throat> hey there. Oh, I remember you, brother. Thanks to you, we're now able to open up shop again. Give you a special price on hot spring water. That was 20 rupees. Bye. Yes. <coughs> now I can talk to what's... I mean, I feel like a glass bottle isn't the best way to keep liquids warm anyway, but I guess uh, you just can't get thermoses in this day and age. Don't have to be, uh, well, I mean... <laughs> Brother, you have the sweet smell of hot spring water. If I took a drink of that, I would feel so strong. I could probably get rid of these rocks. But if you want to get through here, give me that hot spring water you have there, sure. Yeah. <sighs> yes, Goron power, go! Well, I'm going to get to working on this, so you should come back in a little. Well, in the morning, that should be gone, probably. Yeah, but now I can go down this hole because I have a double claw. want to swim in that water. Get out of that? Did I get a piece of heart? No, I don't. Did I get money? Guys, I don't even remember what I just got out of that chest. I'm not gonna work. Alright, RC, you have a good one. Plenty of rest for tomorrow. I should make something for dinner. I have fish. I have fish. Right. You're joining. Have a good one, cat. Thank you for stopping by as usual. I hope that you had a good day. Hope that you get one. Not so bad. That, uh, that's a, that's some good time on there. Huh. Well, hey. welcome, welcome. The hero of discounts, Malomart, will be a legend in Castle Town. Come in, on in. Welcome. Take a look at our wares. Would have taken like five minutes. True, but I, oh god, I forgot that everybody in here is dancing. There's someone in this portrait stream. Oh. God, this cult. 
Oh, what? Oh, yeah, he has a weird... <laughs> it could make a thermos. He's just... He's, he's got... We'll buy it now if you're smart at Malomart. Welcome, welcome. Grand opening sale going on at Castletown Malomart. 20% off, 30% off, of course, why not? We look out for you, the hero of discounts, that is us, Malomart. Buy it now if you're smart. Yeah, okay. God, I hate watching him sidle. Uh, uh, in HD, this is even more unsettling. Alamart stamp, one of a kind. I'll take it. Bye. Good night, princess. Love you too. I hope that you get plenty of rest. We will talk more on the morrow. Well, for me. For you, it's already time. Don't worry about that. Good night, Zunder. Oh yeah, because you're also, you guys, yeah. Okay, I think I'm probably gonna get off myself and not go to bed. It's not even 8 p.m. yet. But I should think about what I'm gonna make for dinner and also figure out some other things. So like I said, I really gotta pee. Fancy dreams of the future. But yeah, like I said, we will definitely be playing the great Ace Attorney tomorrow. And we'll see. I've heard from everybody who's played it that it's fantastic and that like, because I was really starting to, to feel the drag from the last few games, like especially the final cases and all that. And apparently it's it's just very good all around. So I'm like, you know what? I'm ready. I'm ready. One with the wine leg guy, yeah. And also, uh, Herlock Sholmes. No relation to anybody else who might have a similar name. Who is apparently just an amazing character. So I'm like, man. Oh, I blew up the air. Yeah. Well, we'll see. I don't know. Uh, to be fair, I'm not sure like where all the characters show up in that. Yeah, I have not watched any of it. I wanted to make sure I wasn't spoiled at all. But yeah, I know Beth showed me a picture, and I was like, oh, I, I think I've seen. Like, I I know what some of the characters. Are. But not like all of the antagonists. I guess the lore you're going, yeah, yeah probably. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, as long as it's not another freaking Nayuta Sadmati, I'll be happy because he just made me hate, like, Anytime he was on the other side, I'm like, man, I don't want white hair, rosaries. Okay. Yeah. We made a lot of progress. Total play time. Yeah, almost 27 hours. Nice. Good stuff. <laughs> 